hello everyone welcome to the channel if you are facing this issue guys disk one unknown and not initialized so this video is for you i will show you how to troubleshoot this issue step by step okay so let's start the process without wasting our time guys so first of all uh, you can get this issue in a two way like first one is unallocated and the second one is disk not initialized and disk doesn't have any space on it so how to troubleshoot this issue step by step so first of all if your disk is raw and first time you have inserted in your system so you can simply right click on this blank area okay this area not this one you need to click on this area right click and simply click on initialize disk click on ok and once you initialize this it should show up with the online disk if you are facing any kind of issues after initializing this disk so you need to use the command prompt in order to fix this issue guys so simply if the disk is initializes it, it's online now let me show you you can format it like this okay click on ntfs click on next and your disk will be formatted and will be showing up here if uh, this option is not working you have to open the cmd guys so all the data will be lost from your disk okay and you need to type for the command make sure to run the command prompt as admin and you need to type for disk part without any space now list space disk and once you do that you can see here the disk one make sure you choose the correct disk uh, you need to make sure that you have chosen the correct disk here the disk one and its capacity size free up space okay once you have selected that you need to type as select disk space one okay now we need to type her command clean all the data will be lost from that drive and once you do that the disk part succeeded successfully you will see this message now after that you need to type for the command convert space gpt if you have the new volume and system type this gpt or you can try with the mbr both are same but just a file system okay i am going to give gpt and once you have selected the gpt we need to format the disk here now now we need to type the command create partition space primary and hit the enter key once we have seen the succeeded in uh, creating the specific partition now in order to format that you need to type for the command format space quick space fs is equal to nt fs and hit enter key you need to type here the fs fs is equal to nt fs now you can see disk is formatted completely disk now we need to assign the drive letter to it so assign and hit the enter key and now this should fix your issue guys so once you have assigned the letter to it you can run this command just you need to exit out from here and you need to type for the chkdsk space forward slash f space forward slash r and then the drive letter e now the drive letter is f in my case f colon hit the enter key and this will complete it like this it will go to five stages once it is done you have to restart your system and your issue will be fixed so i hope guys after applying this method your issue is fixed then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching